am so excited for today. As you can see behind me, I am so excited over today. So today we are going to talk about a fantastic thing I got in the mail. I can't believe it, I can't believe it, I'm sorry. I'm so excited, I can't hold it back. I gotta tone it down a little because I'm really excited. All right, I've been dying to open this up and I've been waiting till I do a video to open it. So here we go, we've got a gimbal. Look at this fantastic, beautiful item. Look at this. I am so excited over this. Look at the back. This. I am extremely excited over this. So, if you guys watched my videos before, <laughs> we all know I can't, I can't sit still to save my life. So, when we hit that hand pay on my channel and I was like, oh my gosh, I gotta get something to keep this thing from moving all around and jumping. And so I've been doing a lot of research, talking to a lot of other channels. And when I did my research, I saw this is one of the top 10. So I was really excited over that. So this is the Zion here. This is the gimbal. So I'm really excited over this. Now I'm gonna tell you a little bit about it. But first, let's look at this. So it has a carrying case. Look at this carrying case. Isn't this awesome? I love it. All right. So I peeked. I had to peek because I, I didn't want to do this. I didn't want to open it until I did it on video. So here we go. Look at this. Look at this, you guys. I'm so excited. I don't even know the first thing to do with this. I just thought I'd let you know. I was reading it just a few minutes ago and it was telling me I have to download something. Didn't have a clue because why? I didn't want to do this until I did it with you on camera. So let me tell you a little bit about this. It says that it is the Smooth 4, which I'm really excited over it. Um, it also says that it is the Zion Smooth 4 handheld smartphone gimbal stabilizer. Gimbal stabilizer. Um, it is how amazing is it recording every touch moment touching moment how exciting is that and enjoying the colorful and wonderful life Zion smooth for gimbal born for mobile mobile filmmaking see that we can go walk the park and you won't see the bounciness, which I'm ecstatic over. I can't believe it. I, I'm really excited over this. So it says tips for using your Smooth 4 gimbal. Number one tip is please balance the gimbal and power off, off status. Woo! Okay, let's start that sentence over one more time, you guys. Okay, it says, please balance the gimbal in power off status before starting it. And of course, upgrade your software. So we have to make sure our software, which I don't have any software downloaded on my, on my phone. So I need to definitely do that. So I'm really excited over the pictures because I think it, it gives it no justice. If you could see this thing in front of me, it, it's, it's amazing. I'm, I'm so excited. I'm, I'm messing up my words. But look how amazing this is. I, I just... I'm so excited over this. Okay, so it says making your own smooth videos. You want a focus, pull, and zoom capability. I'm trying to look at you guys and read at the same time. It's not that easy. All right, so you want smoothly zoom in and out for footage and create more diverse images by rotating its unique. Oh, you can see it right there on the camera. That's the rotating. That's perfect timing. All right, so you want to go ahead and diverse images by rotating its unique follow focus hand wheel. So that's exciting. So let's take some of this out. First of all, we have a charger. See that? Yay! Oh, it takes a C, by the way, just to let you know. Here is the stand. I think the stand is so cool. You can either hold it like this. Look at this. Damn. Okay, where's the picture? We need the picture to show you the stand. <laughs> Sometimes when you try to do this and you try to get the pictures just right so that way they follow you, it's not easy. All right, so here's the stand, which I'm glad I got this right in front of me because I'm, oh, this is heavier than I thought. Okay, let's get this out. 
Look at this big contraption. Okay, so you can either have it, you can either have it like this, or you can put the stand on it. It's a whichever way you prefer to use it. Ooh, I definitely need to educate myself on this thing. What's this thing do? I don't even know. Look, I'm just twisting stuff. I need somebody on here with me who knows how to use it. Okay, so this moves it up and down. This little knob here. Let's tighten that back up. This little knob should move this around. Okay, tighten that back up. And of course, extender to put your phone on there. Ow! Don't pinch your finger, that's for sure. Oh Lord. Okay, then we can turn it this way. Don't know how to make it stay yet. Because, like I said, I'm learning how to use this as we speak. Isn't that the crazy part? But it does lock. So we can leave it in one category. Now I do know it has power on, power off, and I'm pretty sure it looks like it needs to have be charged. I do not have it charged. It's got all kinds of buttons on here. Look, we got buttons on the back, buttons on the front. This is crazy, we got buttons all over the place. Let's learn. Oh look, there we go. It comes with the carrying case, the stand that I was telling you about right here at the bottom, the stand. Perfect picture, love it, love it. All right, so let's go over some of the unique of what it has. Okay. I wish I had this. I didn't even think about opening this up and charging that. Farthest thing from my mind. This is definitely not long enough for me to talk. Okay, so let's go over some of what it has. All right, so let's go over some of what it has. I do need my glasses. I can't believe I'm trying to do this without my glasses on. There we go. Okay. Okay, so first of all, what we have on here is we have our menu button here. We have our detailed perimeter. This is our fill light that's right here. We also have our focus and zoom button here. This is for options. Okay, on the back we have phone go mode. We have the full follow mode. Then we have our pan follow mode. And then make it go down, that's locking mode. Then we have our on off button. So I am very, very, very excited to get this started. I'm very excited to sample this out to see how it works. Um, we'll definitely have to have a video showing us using the item because I am ecstatic about over this item. Um, I'm excited to find out how everything works. Um, I haven't tried it yet. Let me know if you guys have a gimbal. How do you like your gimbal? Is there anything in particular, any tips you can tell me about it? Um, I am very excited to find out how to use this. Um, oh, we have another charger here. Let's see. I'm very excited to get this started to see what all the options do because this is very exciting. I do know that uh, for this part, you need to charge so when it moves. Actually, I'm sorry, this, my bad. I am so sorry. This part is for your phone. That I do remember. I remember somebody telling me about that part. So I do remember that. But when I did my reviews on this, like I said, this was one of the top tens and I was very excited over this. So I'm, I'm very excited to get this started. And just to let you know, we do have our user guide, which I'm definitely gonna dig into this bad boy and really get it started. They also give you download options, so you can just take the picture of it and it'll go ahead and download for you, which I really like that option. 
Okay, so the first step is charge it. That's exactly what they say. I'm going to show you that. That's kind of funny that the first thing they show you on here, step one, is you want to charge it. All right, so step two is the installation. Get the tripod ready. So you can go ahead and put your tripod on the bottom, which remember we have our tripod here. As you can see here, it will screw right at the bottom, right at the bottom here, and we can screw that right in. I'm not gonna do that quite yet. Okay, let's see what our next step is. So we can make sure we do everything the right way. Okay, the next step is long, Press power button for two seconds to turn on or off the stabilizer. Okay, as you can see here. All right, step four. Right, this are our four operation modes, which we kind of went over those modes of what we have. We have the pan follow mode and the locking mode. Remember those were right here at the bottom. Okay, then we have our phone go mode and our following mode, which those are located at the back. Right here at the back, these two right here. I feel like I'm playing the guitar. Okay. Then we have the quick switch to standby mode. Hold the horizontal arm, which is this horizontal arm and again that does move out and then you're able to hold it up to the horizontal arm again to wake up the stabilizer and that's where we need to have this on so what will happen it, it will actually hold it there once it's powered on that's what it's telling me till I try it I don't know that for sure we are gonna have a sample on this I'm really excited to show you guys when we get this done. We're just opening it right now and learning about it. The next video is gonna be, how do you use it? But we just don't have a phone and we haven't downloaded the app yet. So until we do all that, we are unable to fully show you how to use it. So once we can get it downloaded, I'll show you how to use it. That'll be another video. But right now, I just wanna do my unboxing on my new gimbal. I am ecstatic over this. So. I'll have the video out in a few days to show you how to use it. So I'm excited. Thank you so much for stopping in and visiting with me. I love to see you guys. Don't forget to, of course, like. Don't forget to subscribe if you're not. Of course, share me out. You know I love when you share me out. Leave me a comment if you like. Let me know if you have a gimbal. What kind of tricks can you tell me? Because again, I'm going to do a video in just a few days on how to use it. All right. Thanks so much for watching. You guys have a great day. I'll see you later. Bye-bye now.